A little business from the heartland of the South Island is proving irresistible to overseas buyers. The Denheath Custard Square is about to put South Canterbury on the map. Mike Thorpe went to see what all the fuss is about. The Denheath Custard Square has long featured in cafe cabinets around South Canterbury. Mm. You want some, don't you? Now the slice of culinary history is going global. My mum had a dream that we could take it to, to the rest of New Zealand initially and then she really wanted to take it overseas. Sadly, Lisa Templeton's mum didn't get to see her wish come true. She died just as the business was expanding from its small town birthplace. The famous Denheath Custard Square originated here in Pleasant Point, but as demand grew, production needed to as well. So they upped sticks and went to the big smoke. To Maru. Not that they've lost sight of where they've come from, but it's where they're going that's creating the buzz. After being discovered by multinational wholesalers Costco, these Kiwi custard squares are bound for Australia, the US and Korea, and there's talk of Taiwan and Japan taking off too. The excitement factor uh, and the challenge really is to get the product into the new markets and to see the reaction from it. Mum would be just so proud. Going worldwide is a big job, especially for a small team turning out more than 20,000 squares a week. This Australian bound order is loaded with 60,000 custard squares. What's going, guys? Whoa! We are growing um, and we probably need some more people. At least experienced taste testers shouldn't be too hard to find. Dangerous, but absolutely brilliant, yeah. We have them every time we can. From Timaru to Timbuktu, these small treats are proving big business. Mike Thorpe, One News.